the sun hasn't come up yet so we're going to try to do our best to show you guys what we're seeing by using our cell phone light here are you filming us yeah we have a um not you but we have a youtube channel where we go around to garage kind of like american pickers oh. um just seeing what cool stuff we can find it's just hard to film when it's the sun's not out yet i know well that's cool little starbucks cup with a mermaid on it is this your table oh wow what? okay all right do i have to ask her for a price on this okay okay <laughs> sounds good you're just security to keep me from taking yeah, it Yeah. Oh yeah. Breakfast of champions. This uh, Starbucks cup with the mermaid on it. A dollar. Dollar. Okay, I'll do that for you. All right. Thank you. Thank are you, ma'am. Are you Miss Paula? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna get these shoes. It has a okay. five on it. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Teaks. Sick. It's a bucket list item. Those are all brand new, oh. not used. Brand new Yeti cups. What are you asking for those? Well, I need to get at least fifteen for uh, the whole set. Fifteen They're for four expensive. of them. Yeah. yeah. I'll do. Um, let me see if I got anything else. I can give okay. you an even 20. This Pac-Man game is pretty neat. Kids hardly use it. Yeah. <laughs> so it does work? Yes, it does. And okay. I would like to try to get 40 for it. Okay. I need to wipe it down, but um, it's due. Yeah, that's, that's not too bad. What are you asking for this jacket here? That is from Peru. So, yeah, I figured it had like llamas or something yes. on it. It looked kind of cool. Um, you know, I need to get 25 for it. 25. What they say they make it out of the alpaca hair. Yeah. And these pillows up here. Oh, also, those are all al those alpaca? Those are baby alpaca pillows. And oh, wow. Stuff them. Yeah. So it was 20 on this, yeah. 40 on the Pac Man's. So that puts you yeah. at 60. 60. Then 75. Yeah. Could you do 60 for everything? Yeah. I could okay. do that for That's you. Awesome. Let's see what we got here. All right. There you go. I got, oh, I got my okay. own bag down here. Okay. So we'll awesome. take care of it. Thank you so okay, much. You're this is really quite cool. welcome. I see that IKEA yeah. bag. Yeah, that's right. We've actually got a bag that's even bigger than this one. Oh my goodness. But we didn't bring that one today. Thank you so much. There you go. You're quite welcome. Helping you clear stuff out before, oh, before yes, sunrise. Oh, you're a blessing. <laughs> what about this? It's a Dooney and Burke Disney purse. Oh my goodness. What you got on it? 200. Oh, 200. Okay. I mean, there's $5 on these. That looks really cool, but I don't know if it's worth that. That vacuum cleaner is not very old. Yeah, it looks great. Um, I got $500 on it because the vacuum cleaner itself is $1,000. Wow. wow. It's the and, Roomba? And then it has, yeah, it's the iRoomba. Okay. It's the 9S series. Hmm. Um, and then, of course, my bags. I looked those up online to see how much they were worth nowadays. Yeah and they're priced appropriately there's no wear and tear I, they were too small for me i need the big tote yeah that one i looked up online mm -hmm. and the price is for i found the one with the beige the beige handles yeah yeah i could not find the black one anywhere. Yeah. so i'm like well if i can't find it it's maybe probably worth a lot more maybe it's rare who knows and i got it in um 2018 was when we went to visit yeah um, went down to florida well, it's really clean that's for sure and i can if you if you want it for 150 i can give it to you for 150. okay so this this red one's it's not a dooney it's just like a disney yeah, branded a it says on the front like right underneath the where does it say that? Right there in the black writing, right under your hand. Oh, that says Minnie Mouse. Minnie Mouse, yeah. Yeah, I think it might be just Disney, but it's still cool either way. Oh, okay, yeah, it is Disney Parks exclusive. But I looked it up on online, and I'll take 40 for it. What about um, 160 for both of them? <laughs> I'll take it. You'll do that? Mm -hmm. Okay. Be 160 for you. So I got the Dooney and the and the Disney. All right, thank you so much. Thank you. We appreciate the deal. Yep. Good luck. You know what? Go ahead and take that coach too if you want it. This this one? Yeah, go ahead and take it. Okay. Cool. I really didn't think I would sell those today, so I'm glad I did. Yeah, absolutely. Awesome. Thank you so much. Yep. I appreciate that.
Good morning. Morning. How are you? Doing good. Doing good. Thanks for coming out. Uh, thanks for thanks for coming out <laughs> even earlier. Out bringing it out. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Do you know if any of these are Starbucks cups? Or no, they just... no Starbucks. No. Okay. No. You got a Starbucks? It's got not a Starbucks. Uh, oh yeah, we're, we. But uh, you know what? They do vinyl. We can put that. Yeah, we just, <laughs> just slap a Starbucks <laughs> label on the. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Hello, That's all they do. She was asking two hundred for the Dooney, mm -hmm. fifty for the Mickey, and twenty five for this one. I got all three for one sixty. Oh, nice. I paid one sixty just for the Disney and the Dooney, and then she gave me the coach for free. Wow. It was crazy. Maybe the sun will be out by the time we get to the next sale. Morning. Yeah, what's, what's up? up? How are you? Eric Tornado, what's up, brother? I watch the show all the time, man. I love it. Love YouTube to hear channel. it. Love to hear it's it. It's great, man. Yeah, man, it's good to see you. Good to see you. What was your name? Nick. Nick. Yes. Awesome. How long have you been watching? Since you started, man. Years. Wow. Probably two, three years. Or That's yeah. awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Love great, it. Man. These are neat. So the, the patent for toilet paper solves the, the age old question if it's supposed to go over or under. Yeah, I guess so, yeah. Absolutely. Over. See, I'm an over kind of guy. She's it, under guy. Yeah. Girl, so. This just proves that she's wrong. Exactly. That's, you should keep That's this. That's why I've been trying to tell you it's so much easier to have it on top. <laughs> it is, it really is. <laughs> Logitech. This thing's like a trackpad or something. These are cool. I think people would buy them, but it's just hard to ship something like this, especially with all the glass. So we're probably gonna, probably gonna pass. But definitely cool. Reebok CrossFit shoes. I saw those. I was leaving them for you. You were leaving them for me? How mm -hmm. nice. I don't really know how much they go for. The CF74, I mean, probably like 25 bucks. Those look big though, like a men's 12 or 13. Some little 3DS Star Wars case. That's cool. Yeah, these are in great shape. Did you get anything? No. Okay. All right, so here's our pile. Got your trackpad, 3DS case, and the shoes. What you want? Make me offer, man, because you know I can't overprice the tornado. <laughs> you can. People no. do it all the time. They do. <laughs> I know. I see you do it, man. Uh, let me let me look this up because I have no idea what this is worth. Do what you gotta do, man. I don't want to offer you twenty bucks if this is worth a hundred bucks or something. You know. Just look at there. Six sold, sixty bucks. So I was I was gonna offer you like twenty bucks, but now I gotta I gotta offer you more. You know. That looks that looks pretty good. So how about uh? How about, how about 40 yes, bucks? I'll take it, man. Okay. Because it's you, I'll do whatever. Yeah, that way, don't, don't, need, don't need change. I think that's fair. Yes, Thanks, man. I mean, we Appreciate watch it. Josh and Haley all the time. All the time. Okay? <laughs> love it. Love it. Thank and you guys so much. We should have brought Rose with you, man. You we should have. I know. <laughs> we should have. Well, thanks, guys. Appreciate Thank it. You. Thank you all for bringing everything out for us. We appreciate it. Good luck. Good morning. Morning. How are y'all? Remember the time we found this at the bins and I called it like a. Uh, uh, something that your dog pees on. <laughs> if you're like, no, that's a bottle drainer, Josh. Weather station. No wires or software. This looks kind of cool. These are Go GoPros. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I've got terrible posture. Yeah, we've got a we've got a YouTube channel where we kind of just go to garage sales, flea markets, thrift stores. Three things so far. Three things? What'd you get? A black hat, a car hat, and a car hat shirt, and they're all a dollar. Okay. I'm gonna try to get this. Looks brand new. Shooting kit, five bucks. That's kind of neat. Smith's Be Ready Survival Multi Tool, five bucks. You already looked through all this over here? Okay. All salt life stuff. Okay. Were you guys asking for this car heart bag? What? That bag. What about the bag? How much is it? Oh, uh, how much do you want for your Carhartt bag, honey? Five. Five, five bucks? Okay. okay. Five, six, seven. This was a dollar. Eight. eight. So I have eight dollars okay. worth of okay. stuff. And eight, eight, ten, eight, eighteen and twenty-five. Twenty-five, so that's thirty-five and forty-three. Forty-three, thank 40. you. <laughs> it's early. So forty. So forty is <laughs> well, great. Forty even, that'd be great. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Okay. Grab a bag. I'll get it from the people. Oh, we, don't, we don't need one. You don't need bags? Yeah, oh, we'll okay. just throw it in there. Perfect. There you Thank, you so Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. We appreciate you guys. Thank you. So after a few hours of hitting some garage sales on a beautiful fall Saturday morning, my wife Haley and I were able to get all of these items for a grand total of $306. 
dollars. But now to answer the real question, how much money are we gonna make from selling all this stuff? This Carhartt duffel bag should sell for about $30 plus shipping. This lacrosse weather monitoring station is brand new in the box. It just has a little bit of box damage and I think we can get close to 100 bucks plus shipping. This long sleeve Carhartt shirt that Haley found should sell for about 15 bucks or so. This blue Glock hat was super cool, probably about 15 to $18 plus shipping on that. And this Carhartt hat, maybe eight to 10 bucks plus shipping. This eye and ear shooting protection kit is from a local store called Palmetto State Armory. It's probably worth about 20 bucks or so. And this other little multi-tool survival thing, I couldn't find comps on this, but I imagine it's probably worth about 18 to 20 bucks. This alpaca wool jacket is super cool, but there's no tags or anything, so it's really hard to determine a value. But I think we could probably get about 40 to 50 bucks for it. These four Yeti coffee mugs were pretty neat, but I have heard some people talk about having issues selling this stuff on eBay. So we're probably gonna sell them over on Whatnot for like 15 bucks a piece. This Star Wars Nintendo 3DS case is super cool, but it's only worth about $8 or so plus shipping. This Starbucks tumbler had a really interesting mermaid pattern on it. It looks like it's gonna sell for about 16 to $18 plus shipping, but I couldn't find an exact sole comp for this tumbler. It's pink and smooth, and all I can find are the ones that are studded. So I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that this is probably worth about 20 bucks. However, I was able to find a sole comp for these Reebok CrossFit shoes. I think we can get about 35 bucks plus shipping. This tabletop Miss Pac-Man game is actually worth about 100 bucks plus shipping, and it does work. <laughs> Haley and I have been looking for a pair of Teak's ballet slippers for years, and this is the first pair we have ever found. These should sell for anywhere from 65 all the way up to about $80 plus shipping. This Logitech rechargeable trackpad, specifically model T651, should sell for about $60 free shipping, so like 50 bucks plus shipping. To be honest, I don't really know much about this coach purse that she threw in for free, other than it has a little stain on the front right there. It does look and feel authentic. I just don't think it's super valuable, maybe like 40 bucks or so, I'm not really sure. I thought this little mini mouse purse was super cool. It's not worth a ton of money, maybe like 25, 30 bucks or so. It is in great condition, so hopefully it does sell fast. And last but certainly not least is this Dooney and Burke purse with the Disney print. This thing is just in fantastic condition. Disney stuff does well and Dooney and Burke does well, so putting them both together just makes sense. Even the bottom of this purse is super clean and you just don't see that very much these days. Here's Moe's doing a little new goods inspection. Everything's checking out. Not only is the outside super clean, but the inside is super clean as well. In new condition, this purse sells for over $300. In this condition, I think we can get about $250 for it. So our total potential gross profit from just a few hours of yard selling on a Saturday morning is $630. If you guys want to see the very best thing we have ever found at a garage sale, click this video right over here. Thank you guys for watching. You're the best and we will catch you on the next one.